Are you tired of high pressure tactics? No, I'm not gonna sign that, it's too much. At Community Auto Group, you'll find we have a straightforward approach. If other dealers have made you uncomfortable, give Community a try. You'll enjoy your experience here and find a straightforward deal that's right for you, not high pressure tactics. Community Auto Group, straightforward deals from the straightforward dealer. There was a motion by Bodecker, second by uh, Pierce, to establish an MIS task force for the purposes of providing a sounding board for the acting director on MIS priorities and direction, supporting the management of the department and acting as a liaison with the Board of Supervisors and the committee. Uh, the uh, task force will be composed of the personnel director, the MIS chair, MIS vice chair, and the sheriff representing the entities outside the courthouse. Uh, that um, would require board action, um, you know, uh, presuming that you're uh, agreeable to that. The, uh, the next item is similar, it would require board action. There was a motion after considerable discussion by Tom Drzemski, uh, seconded by Kevin Powell, to hire McGladry to conduct the management uh, and staff assessment. I won't read that whole thing. But basically to review where the department is at uh, from a management uh, standpoint and provide uh, hard information from people who do this kind of thing and, and have the expertise. Um, Tom can comment on that further if he wants to at the right time. That, right now we've got a proposal from the Galatory that uh, members of this task force are uh, reviewing and uh, taking a look at the scope of services. Uh, we've had a conversation with the Galatory that provided a draft to us, um, and we will be responding to that draft with uh, perhaps some um, some minor modifications to um, so that we've we've got a clear understanding of what those what that scope of services entails. Um, estimated cost of that is about twenty-four thousand dollars. We would bring that agreement um, to the board once once we've got it uh, flushed out. Again, that item would require action by the board of supervisors. That recommendation would require your action to move forward. The uh, next highlighted item uh, there was a motion by Bob Becker, second by Kelly, to recommend the addition of the county conservation director. I think there was uh, unanimous consensus that uh, that, that, would be, that would be a good thing. The first highlighted item, uh, motion by Dale and seconded by Bo Deckard to communicate to you, the Board of Supervisors, about no confidence in MIS Director Scott Tepner's ability to manage the department. That motion passed unanimously, and happy to respond to questions on any of these uh, issues. Is there anybody else that would like to speak? I was at, I was at the meeting and uh, I was uh, surprised, maybe not surprised, but uh, it was quite a meeting and there isn't uh, an awful lot of faith in, in Mr. Uh, Chapman. Uh, but I think we need to be talking to our legal counsel about what we should be doing next. I, uh, I don't know just how to handle this, but I think we'll let our legal counsel lead us on that anyway. Is there anybody else? I yeah. guess I, yeah, go ahead. I'll add one comment. Um, I think everybody on the committee feels that the county is very dependent on MIS and without any leadership um, and then we have an interim leader who isn't quite uh, he, 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 sure which direction to take the guy you know I mean there was some questions and stuff so I think the committee feels that we need to uh, kind of move forward one direction or another so we can get some leadership established and 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 whatnot so the county can keep running because the technology everybody relies on this technology and when something goes down we can't perform our essential functions of our jobs so it's important
important that we keep our MIS department um, running efficiently. And if I may, the uh, you know the, the scope and the uh, direction we're going, or you know, I'm gonna pick on Sandy there for a moment, or ever changing. Like she just presented something else we've got to do uh, for TIP, and it's you know nothing static, and it's just and uh, we just gotta be moving along. A lot of these recommendations recommendations are you know gonna be just for the betterment of uh, public service and uh, to. Uh, Take care of things. So, but any anything else out there? Okay. I guess Up my I guess my suggestion would be that on the um, agenda for for next week, uh, you have the appointing of the conservation director to the MIS steering committee, and the appointment of the of the task force as well uh, on next week's agenda. Um, and then uh, we may or may not have the McGlattery agreement uh, okay. to you uh, in time for that meeting. I'm gonna be gone the rest of this week, but um, certainly uh, be coordinating with the other members of that task force as well, um, so that perhaps we could have it to you uh, next Tuesday at the early um, well, you know, I'm, I'm certainly willing to, uh, to talk with our legal counsel more with regards to uh, the situation with Mr. Tapner. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and another comment, it's just nice to see uh, there's a lot of ideas in different groups from uh, the engineering department to the auditors to everything, uh, everyone seems to be in consensus here. It's nice, you know, as a group to get together and have a lot of different ideas, everyone seems to be on the same page, so that's just, nice working relationship to have uh, come to the uh, conclusion of some things and then to enhance the uh, department further on down the road. Andy, is it appropriate you want to say yes, I, or no, or anything? Nope, I guess I don't really have any comments. On okay. Right now, I think, yep. you know, the minister I think, speak for themselves. So. Okay. I think probably 80% of the people that's on that committee are here this morning, so mm -hmm. we appreciate the yes. confidence. That that uh, you're uh, staying right with this situation. I have two comments. Yeah. Um, these are personal comments. First, um, I certainly don't wish any ill will or fortune to uh, Scott, um, and I don't thank any member of this committee. Uh, I think we would all share the sentiment. Uh, second, uh, certainly my vote has nothing to do with the uh, legal issues. The outcome of legal issues are not dependent on how I voted on this this was not my motion uh, this is not a motion I initiated or encouraged but I'm just expressing my uh, personal take uh, as to uh, what that constituted and what it did but anything else for oh. okay thank you gentlemen. yeah thank you and, and everyone else on the MIS steering committee and uh, with that these are